Hello everyone, my name is Master Starman and welcome back for more Let's Play Mega Man 2 on Mega Man The Wily Wars. Last time, we finished up in Woodman, Quick Man, and Dr. Wily Stage 1. Had an amazing time with Quick Man. Awful friggin' time with Wily 1. Oh my god! I haven't been more frustrated at a video game in a long time. Because that stage sucked. In this part, we're going to be continuing on the Wily Castle here with Wily Stage 2 here. I missed that energy tank, and I really wish I got that. I'll keep that in mind for... <sighs> now I really wish I got that one energy tank and everything else. Um... Yeah, you know what? Let's give that another shot here. I know that extra life might be for moot, but I really want that energy tank now. I realize this is going to be a little bit of grinding here, but I don't really care. After the last level, nothing could be as bad as that one there. Alright, I think I'm ready for this. Let's just give this another shot here. Don't hit the wall. Mother... Alright, let's try this one again here. Um, yeah, this... Okay, so don't jump at the first ladder. We gotta jump at the second one. Okay, got it. That is such a totally worthwhile thing to go after. I know, I realized I died twice in the process, so it's kind of for a moot point, but I really, really wanted that energy tank. Um, oh, hello. So, remember when I said I kind of used save states a little bit in the last video? Yeah, that was kind of... Like, I realized I did kind of save that one energy tank. I could totally... Are you fucking kidding me, game? Are you... F really, game? Alright, weapon energy does not respawn, so keep that scary fact in mind. But yeah, I do realize I have the extra energy tank that I wasted against the dragon in one of those attempts. Honestly, I don't really care. That last stage is so god-awful. I do not give one shit about using those things against it. It was that bad. Like, I do not like that last stage that much that... Like... I'll go as far and say I think it's probably... If not Wily Stage 4, which is probably the most infamous level in this game, then Wily Stage 1, I think, is perhaps the worst. It's that bad. Can I get some ac actual health from these things here? Come on. <sighs> I'm almost dead from this thing, and I don't really like that, because... I don't need that. Is there anything I can use here to make this easier? I don't need weapon energy right now, game! Okay, that is nice there. God! Okay, thank god that dropped a big health pick up there. Yeah, this is like, kind of the part of the game that I don't really care for, I'll be honest. It's- I know it's kind of a weirdly controversial opinion not liking things about this game, but, like, a lot of level design just isn't really that good in Mega Man 2, if I may be honest. Like, these crushers here also do an ass load of damage. I think it might have been reduced, actually, for this collection here, which is a good thing. Uh, I missed that health, but honestly, I don't care. We're at the boss now. This boss is weak to bubble lead here. Let's do this. Metal Blade is also really nice against this boss as well, just because it can hit these guys from, like, halfway across the room here. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I don't really remember this guy's pattern all too well, so, like, that's also kind of a scary thing here that...
There we go. Nice. Oh, man. That fight... Uh, th that's not actually that bad of a boss fight. It's pretty simple. I just... I couldn't remember the thing's pattern, so it was kind of a little word there. Oh, boy. And I think Wily Stage 3, despite its looks, I think is probably one of the easier Wily Stages. Let's see how bad... Okay, people love Wily Stage 1's music, but Wily Stage 3 has some... Bad music, honestly. I don't think that's worth it. I need- We will need crash ammo in a little bit, and believe me, you will need crash ammo in a little bit. Oh, come on. I'll refill that. I can make that with a normal jump, I think. Come on, that- It's a- Okay, let me... Why in the world could I not make that? There we go. Can I make that jump? No. Uh... Okay. Probably not the best use of item 1 there, but honestly, I don't really care. Let's refill with bubble lead here. So, this is pretty much the main gimmick of this level right here. But, honestly, I don't think this level's that bad. It's... treacherous. You have these fish here. Though that actually looked way faster in this version than it did in the 8-bit one. But, yeah. This isn't really that bad, though, all things considered, though. Because you jump really high. This part might suck a little bit, though. Let's see this. Oh, wow! That felt way faster to me than what I was ever used to. This is, I swear, the only extensively hard part of this entire level. Alright, attempt number three at this. Damn it. I really don't want to say, like, pause scum for this, but I might. That's not really as, like, dirty as, like, pause scumming in Mega Man 1, which isn't really in this collection, but... Oof, I thought I jumped too early there. Okay, yep, because you will want to keep doing that there, and then... Yep, okay. One, that was really not as bad as I made it out to be. Also, hold right here for the love of God. Do not hug the left wall there. I don't know whose idea it was to put a spike trap right there, but whoever it was is an asshole. But that's pretty much it for this level, all things considered. I think that's... basically it. If I remember right. Yeah, we're at the boss already. Dan. So yeah, this Gutsman robot here, actually he's not weak to that, he's weak to Quick Boomerang, I think. Yeah, definitely his weakness here. Pretty easy boss, all things considered, just use his weakness, and that's all she wrote. See, very easy Wily stage. I don't know why. I've heard some people say they think that's like one of the harder parts. Like, yeah, that spike drop is kind of tricky, but I'd rather that over... I died to it a couple of times, but I'd rather that than Wily stage 1 any day of the week. And the ass robot is not so bad, but... Okay. Real talk. This is often considered the worst level in the game. Let's see it. Wily stage 4. Make sure your Crash Bomber is full. I probably shouldn't have refilled that. Um, I'll refill item 3 here. Okay. Um, I'll stick with this here. 
I want to have Metal Blade... Actually, I probably shouldn't be using the Metal Blade if I want to keep it healthy for this, because we're going to need it a lot for, like, some of the late-game bosses, and remember on hard mode... Oh, right, yeah. A lot of these platforms are fakes, so keep that in mind here. Um... Yeah, remember, we're going to be using our Metal Blade a lot for some of the late-game bosses, and hard mode is kind of a bitch sometimes. As are these invisible floors. If you want an easy trick for these, using Bubble Man's weapon is actually very, very beneficial. Because Bubble Man's weapon will show you where there's fake floors. Very, very, very nice. Yeah, so like right here. Actually, I don't need that. No. Okay. I'm just gonna leave that there. This stage is otherwise still pretty dang difficult, though, besides that. Because of this bullshiper. Eee! Oh, no. No! No! Damn it! Oh, my God. I should have just damaged scummed against that guy, but that was asking for too much there. I didn't realize unpausing on the ladder would have kicked me off it. I know that's a quirk with a lot of these games, but still, I for some reason thought that that was fixed here. Yeah, so... We can use it items like item 1 and item 2 to make this part a little bit on the easier side, but... Yeah, and for the most part, remember you don't need to ride all of these all the way. I like these rooms that don't have the flying guys anywhere in the room, which are usually pretty nice. I don't actually consider the, this level inherently that bad, but the boss fight is a royal, royal pain in the ass, especially if you don't know what you're doing, really. Thankfully, I think this one just kind of drops you on that platform, which is very, very nice. And we have another easy room here at the end here. If you want to use item 2 to get across this quicker, that's also a very much possibility. Actually, yeah, that's actually a very good idea now that I think about it, because... Um, that, that thing kind of, like, hugs the ceiling and kind of kicks you off, which can be a little bit awkward. So keep that in mind if you're trying to do that without any sort of items or anything. I'm not gonna bother fighting these things. Well, I'll fight this one since you're kind of smack dab in the middle of my path here. Do we have another big one here? Yeah. Oh god. Oh god, I am not ready for this. Alright, get out item one here and be prepared for an obnoxious as shit boss fight. This fight is the worst in the game by a long shot. This fight is really, really that bad. Please tell me that got the eat, but no, damn it. Oh, I can't take the easy way out of this. You have just enough crash shots to fight this thing. And its shots are borderline impossible to dodge sometimes. Come on, disappear here. I hate the fact that I'm, like, considering using energy tanks here, but this fight is that bad. This fight is that bad. You have just enough crash shots to kill this guy, and it's that god-awful. I do I, I have hated this fight ever since I first played this game, but I hate it even more in retrospect, because it is super... Super bad. <sighs> Damn it. <sighs> C 
come on, no, I don't want to use a second energy tank against this guy, but I- FUCK! Guess where the checkpoint was, by the way! Guess what we need to refill all the way? WHY IS THIS THE BEST MEGA MAN GAME?! Oh my god! FUCKING END ME! Alright, let's attempt this on round two. I'm just gonna say straightforward. I don't give a shit. Oh! I actually- I didn't realize one major difference with this version of the fight here. There's- once you destroy some of these barriers here, they do disappear. That can make things a lot more tolerable. But, does that change that this fight is still a crock of shit? No. Because this fight is still a total crock of shit. You will not hear me say otherwise. <sighs> can I make this stupid- Okay, thank god, that's the jump I wanted to make. Let's just do that there. And we just have the one guy left. I'm so freaking terrified because I feel like I will die. Nope, I won't. I won't. Thank God! That's gonna do it for this episode of Mega Man 2. Join me back next time for the finale. Because my God, I cannot wait to end this piece of shit game. I'll see you guys for that then. Peace out.